I, we're currently in the airport. It's like 4.30. We've been here for an hour and a half. Really tired. And checking bags. Got my boarding pass and passports. We got off the plane. I slept on the plane. I wasn't supposed to, but I did. I tried not to. I tried so hard. So now we're gonna get some CFA, Chick-fil-A, and then head on the plane to Seoul. 16, 15, 16 hours? 16 hours. It's a long. 16 hours? Okay. It's a long, it's a long flight. See never. Great. Keep you updated. We made it to Atlanta. There's no Chick-fil-A. In our game. I'm um, really disappointed. I don't like understand. So now we're opting for the basic Starbucks. Buck stars. You got your bread heated because you're needy and basic. <laughs> After what was the longest 16 hours. So long. We are finally in Seoul. Seoul. It's like the nicest place I've ever been in my life. Ever. It's, it's so clean. It's a nice airport. Um, so now we're just waiting for our flight to Chiang Mai. Which will be another six hours. So. Yay. We're almost there. Hey Salise, where are we going? Thailand! <laughs> It. We're through security at Seoul and we're about to go to Chiang Mai. Thailand! Yeah. We on and our we way. We can't sleep on the whole place. Oh. Six hours of just oh, wait, movies. It's here. It's here. So we made it to Thailand. Uh, we are in the Song Tao in Chiang Mai. Um, we're trying to figure out seating and baggage, but soon we will be on our way to the crew facilities and we'll be good. Yep. And it's currently 11, about 11.30 at night. And then over in Austin, it is about 10.40 in the morning. So the time change is really Say hi everyone! Hello. Hi. <laughs> so it is the first morning here in Thailand. Um, we woke up, had breakfast, it was lots of fun. Uh, we went to the crew office and we got to talk about the culture. It was really fun, really interesting. We learned about um, college campuses and just how to properly minister to Thai people. And now we're getting ready to go up the mountain to a Buddhist temple. Oh sweet. Okay, so we just drove up the mountain. Um, we are on our way to the temple. Yeah. Um, it's gonna be super cool. There's like a whole jungle over there. I really like this place. Me too. I like the trees. <laughs> they have nice trees. And the dogs. <laughs> there was the cutest dog in the uh, in the Song Tao. He was just a little nug. He was a little nug. He passed out on the way up here. So we're on our way to the temple. We're gonna get food first. Though. We're gonna get food first. 
So we just had lunch. I had a really spicy dish. I ate a pepper and it was way too much. I had a really spicy dish too, but it was delicious. It was papaya salad. Papaya salad, that sounds good. I got basil chicken and it had a Thai pepper in it, which was so spicy. Um, and then Kevin and I both ate one and it was awful. So now we're gonna hike up the mountain Here we go. to the temple. Woo! hike up one of the longest staircases. I'm not ready for it. <laughs> so tall. My goodness. Let's go. So we were just in the Buddhist temple. Mm -hmm. It was really interesting. So many stairs. 295 stairs. Yeah. I don't up and down. Like it was really interesting being in there because they had there were like lots of Buddhas and there were people that were like, because since that's their religion, that's their whole life. Yeah, um, it was sad to see. But also, like, really fascinating. Yeah, just to see how other people, like, go to church and work through their religion. Yeah. Um, so, and it's also an interesting opportunity for us to learn about the other cultures so that we can minister them better. Because the idea of hope is a lot different between Christianity and Buddhism, which is, like, really encouraging to people because... Then, like, Jesus brings hope when you don't have any. So. Now we're gonna head somewhere. No idea where, though. No idea where. Catch us later. They don't tell us anything until we get there. What do you think of the. I temple? don't want to answer. Water, anyone? It was really cool. It was like, there's a lot of details that you could miss easily. It was really cool. It was super cool, and the architecture is just so amazing, and it's so intricate, and it was really cool. Yeah. What was it like seeing all the people there? It was really interesting. It was interesting. There were a lot of different people there. Like, I heard people speaking German and Thai and English, so that was cool. You see, like, a bunch of different cultures come together. It was also interesting to see like how people had what people had to do yeah. for their own. Like, Your body is gonna pay the same. So crazy. Just pay attention to that. That's very different. Know how long it has. It's 5 o'clock and I'm so tired. 5 o'clock in the morning. Guys, like 4 We're gonna go to Big C. Big C. <laughs> We're gonna get some exchange money. We're gonna go shopping. And I'm gonna take a fat nap. Hopefully not though, because I need to make sure that I don't mess up my sleep schedule. So. Big face. We got waffles. I already ate mine because it was delicious. How's your waffle? It's so good. They were delicious. So we did a bit of shopping. Ian bought a, a turtle. I got this <laughs> ring. I got an elephant. Yeah, we got elephants. We got elephants. You want to see them? We got some cool elephants. Let's look at her elephants. Look at these baby elephants. Yeah. We have to buy one. <laughs> I got mine too. Oh. Wait, like everywhere else, anything screwed. Okay. Oh, yeah. Elephants. That was our shopping haul. Thanks for watching. So I got um, fried chicken and rice. How was it? Oh, it's, it's quite delicious. How's y'all smoothies? So delicious. They taste so fresh. So good. I also got a smoothie. I got passion fruit and mango. It's delicious. It looks really good. You just dip on your pants. You dip on your pants. I just stripped on my pants. So Kevin, what are you getting? Getting two chocolate banana pancakes. Not for me, for the group, I promise.
crew staff trucks. Um, Chloe's here because she hurt her knee and she can bend out more here. I'm back here because I'm a guy, so I get to sit in the fun, not seat places. But it's also really comfy back here, so I'm not complaining. Um, so we're on our way to church um, Sunday morning, wearing pants and collared shirts, so we're nice and hot back here, but thankfully we have air conditioning. So it's uh, lots of fun, really looking forward to it. How's your Thai tea? Excellent as always. Okay, where did you <laughs> okay, so it's pouring on us and it's a little cold, but we're about to get really good food, so it's all worth it. And we got a bunch of cute gifts to give everybody. Kevin also said it wouldn't pour and that it would last like two minutes, but it's pouring and lasting more than two minutes. <laughs> and Aaron's under the umbrella still. All alone. <laughs> Bye. Hi, Aaron. So, how was the rain? Well, it was fine. I do. I just look like I'm. I don't know what to do with my life, and I look like trash. But she peed okay. on half her body. Yeah, from everything from my shoulders to my shoes, I pee all over myself. It's unfortunate, but you know, you just gotta go. <laughs> Pickpocketed. My wallet was in my hand the whole time. I got a coffee mug, a notebook, pants, some baby elephant keychains, some bracelets, and a note card for Michael. It was great. I spent less than a hundred dollars and I got so much stuff. So <laughs> I don't know what that was. I just spent like a thousand. But I feel really accomplished. And like, hopefully everyone will love their gifts, because if they don't, then I'll cry. I honestly, pants We went shopping, it was super fun. I'm so tired, I can barely hold the yeah. camera, so Kaylee's holding it. I got so much stuff, like, yeah, we went really slow the all oh. this, <laughs> you got Birkenstock. and this, and this, and it cost me less than like 50 bucks. Things will be like 100 baht, it's like, oh, it's so expensive. But one dollar is like 30 baht, so it's like three bucks for a pair of pants, which is so good. So I bought way too much stuff. But it's okay. A bot of stuff. <laughs> We are at the uh, sort of like gym thing. Yeah, the crew the office. Crew office across mm -hmm. the street. Um, and we are going to be painting and sweeping so and just excited. fixing it up. I'm really excited. Hopefully I'm going to be doing power washing because yeah. I love power washing. <laughs> yes, so fun. So currently we are sweeping. Um, once it's all sweeped and taped, we will start painting and doing trim and stuff. So we're going to make this place look real nice because yes. currently it looks really run down. Do it before after. Shifting. I will. Good. <laughs> Um, so we. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> this wall is very dirty, so I am uh, power washing it. Look at all that grime. It's a great time. <laughs> Bless you. We're getting I'm high on paint. Real gross. <laughs> yeah, you look gross. So, um, anyways, we'll check in with y'all later. It's doing great. Whoa. 
Eat with your fingers. For dessert with her lunch, we are eating mangoes and sticky rice. But very good. <laughs> We just got a talk from Athletes in Action. It was really cool. They talked to us about their ministry, which is obviously ministering through sports. Because sports is such a universal thing, um, through different economic statuses, but also nationalities, the ability to minister through sports is vital in making sure that you can reach everyone um, and that people are more receptive because like, people like a coach is already teaching them how to like play on the field and so now it's like teaching them how to live off the field. So it's a really powerful ministry that's really helpful. And now we're gonna go eat dinner. And there's so many mosquitoes. There's bugs everywhere. There are so many bugs. And I don't know what to do anymore. It's ridiculous. Look at all those bugs. Jeez. We're gonna sing karaoke and Kate is so excited. This is some Thai fried chicken. <laughs> We just did a lot of karaoke. And I definitely lost my voice, but it's okay. It'll, it'll be fine tomorrow. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. It's an avocado. It's an avocado. Thanks. Sam. I cannot have enough energy to Just put your speak. head on the table. We're really tired. And uh, we just had the staff meeting. We got a really good talk from uh, PJ, did some worship, and now we're gonna head to campus ministries. And then we will die. What did you have for lunch and how was it? Uh, it was amazing. I'm not really sure what the name was because I didn't order it, but it was amazing. I had some fried rice. Yeah. I know it's not that kind of cool, but it's okay. <laughs> um, I had stir fry and it was very yummy. So since uh, the students are on summer vacation, we are just going to do a prayer walk around the campus. Um, and then after that, I don't know what the plan is, but we'll find out eventually, because time will come. So, so we um, did our first day of campus ministry at uh, Rajput University, 
Um, my group went to uh, minister to like two different groups. The first one wasn't very receptive and they had a meeting to get to, so they left pretty early. We didn't get to talk with them a lot. But the second group we were there for, um, I think about two hours. Um, we were talking to them. Uh, they taught us some Thai words. We taught them some English words. Um, we just had a lot of fun. Um, we talked to one of the girls, her name was Foam, and we talked to her about Christ. I, I told her the four spiritual laws, and she said that she she's really interested in uh, Christianity. Um, she has a Christian friend um, who has talked to her before, and she's listened to Christian music, and sometimes when listening, she'll just start crying because, like, she doesn't know why, but it's just that, like, God has touched her heart. Um, so we talked to her about that, um, and then while we were talking to her about that, her Christian friend called, and uh, Paul was able to tell her friend about Crew and uh, ask if she wanted to join Crew, which was really awesome. Um, so then after we had the uh, talk and ministering, we kind of went back and we started talking about uh, just in Texas. Uh, we did swing dancing, Kate and I. Uh, swing danced, I don't know how you say it, did swing dancing, um, and then Chloe and Kate two-stepped and did, uh, they did the Footloose dance. Um, but it was really cool, uh, hopefully we'll be able to talk to her more, whether it be, uh, at campus or just over the internet, um, because she was really interested in the gospel, but just, um, largely it was her family holding back and just, she didn't know enough. But she said that she did read the Bible and she did listen to some Christian music. So it was just really cool seeing the different kinds of people that are on campus and how people are so receptive to the gospel. We are at a traditional uh, Thai family style dinner. So there's a plate with lots of food around it. Um, we're all going to eat, and then we're going to see sort of a dance performance thing of uh, the history of Thailand. And I'm really excited because all this food looks delicious. Elephant show, checking out some elephants. Those were painted by elephants. Like, that kind of thing. That's better than I can do.
hope I get a nice old grumpy elephant who's just ornery. That's my favorite kind. currently at the uh, elephant park and we're riding the elephant. Uh, it's a bit bumpy, not as much now because they're standing still, but it's lots of fun, a little scary. I feel like there is danger at every turn and I'm hoping I don't drop my camera. <laughs> How are you feeling, Adam? Well, this is really fun. Got some sugar cane. It's really good. Currently boarding the raft. I don't even have the energy to pull up my camera, so I'm just using my phone. We're in Seoul, and I'm really tired, and I'm not gonna be able to sleep on the plane anyways, so. No. Just let my, just let my sleeve shirt be. Waiting to board. Yay! So excited. For a, how many hours, 15 hours? Is it 15 hours? A lot of hours flight. We gotta love the US. We touched down in New York, we got our bags, and then found out that it's actually $25 Sorry. a bag to check a bag, and it's yeah. not free. To check a bag. Because Delta Airlines is yeah. great. And it's only in America. Only in America will you ever have to do this, so we weren't. Very tired, very hungry, very, very. Blessed to be back in the greatest country. <laughs> and so now we're gonna. Check her bag apparently. I'm carrying mine on. I don't think I will be able to. I'm gonna have to check it, but 